The Democrats are also trying to rig the election by sending out tens of millions of mail-in ballots using the China virus as the excuse for allowing people not to go to the polls. Hey, we have a virus coming. We have to send — think of it, California. He's going to be sending out millions and millions of ballots. Well, where are they going? Where are these ballots going? Who's getting them? Who is not getting them? A little section that's Republican. Will they be stolen from mailboxes as they get put in by the mailman? Will they be taken from the mailmen and the mailwomen? Will they be forged? Who is signing them? Who's signing them? What, are they signed at a kitchen table and sent in? Will they be counterfeited by groups inside our nation? Absentee ballots are fine. Absentee ballots are fine. Like I live in the White House. And if I can't get to Florida, or you live wherever you live, you can't. But you have to go through a process. Some people just can't make it to a polling station, and they have good reason, but they have to go through this process in order to verify their identity. People went to the polls and voted during World War I. They went to the polls and voted during World War II. We can safely go to the polls and vote during COVID-19. And there is tremendous evidence of fraud whenever you have mail-in ballots. And frankly, if we are really going to protect our elections, and some people don't want to hear this, we must have voter ID.